Today we're talking about hook size. Now this could go on forever, and it certainly can over a good old cold ale, but nonetheless, when you're using the right hook to target the right species that you're after, then you will increase your catches a hundredfold. Believe me, you will. But you must understand that the fish that you're targeting, it does require some homework. You need to understand, I guess, the tackle end of it, the, the pointy part of their face, the mouth. If they have a larger mouth, then you could use a larger hook because you might need that larger bait. But if they have a small mouth like a garfish, for example, you'll have to go a long skinny hook so it does penetrate that smaller mouth above their beak and you can hook the fish up. Quite simple stuff. Let's have a look at these hooks here, what I have, just for argument's sake. I have two long shank hooks. One is, uh, they're both size four. One's a 3191 pattern. And the other one's a very similar pattern, but you can see one has a curved beak on it. Now the curved beak in my situation for what I'm going to use here for whiting, for example, is a better hook because it protrudes back in, and I'll tell you why in a second, but it definitely helps in the hookup, particularly when you want the fish to hook itself. Leaving the rod out there perfectly, a nice long whippy rod, the whiting will suck the bait down, but at the same time when the rod flexes back, it'll hook himself. Pretty simple stuff, great when you're fishing with the kids. Come and have a look at this other hook here. What we have is a standard octopus hook, about a 5-0. The one above it is a 5 as well. But take a look at the barb, very similar to that whiting hook. It protrudes back into itself. It's pretty hard to hook yourself, for sure, but what it will do is help hook the fish. It's a part of a tuna circle design, and this particular hook here is something I would use in the deeper waters when it's a little bit harder to feel the bites. Maybe when you're chasing pearl perch or snapper or trag dew out in those deeper 40 or 50 fathom reefs, which is around 300 feet deep. So a fish that you want to target that helps catch itself, these are the style of hooks that I would highly recommend. There's another helpful tip on behalf of Shimano.